Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. This is Doc Skinner with 1028 Live here at the Sholo International Film Festival in Pine Top, Arizona. And we're going to be speaking with all sorts of amazing people, directors, producers, writers, actors. Um, I already said producers, but everybody. So uh, first off, we're going to start with Diane Musselman. Did I say I that right? Like yes. Yeah. <laughs> good, good. <laughs> and you're here representing Afterthoughts and the Peck situation. Yes. Could you tell us a little bit, not too much, we want people to come see the films. Absolutely. But give them a little elevator pitch. Well, Afterthoughts, which is my baby, I co-wrote and produced along with a fantastic team. It's a paranormal crime thriller, but it has a female lead. Mm -hmm. And you know, in the paranormal crime thriller or paranormal genres, they typically don't have a lot of females who are the heroes. Mm -hmm. And so that's what drew us to it. And the Peck situation, uh, I had the privilege of being a producer on. Uh, Carmen Ellie Wilkerson, who wanted to be here, um, decided she wanted to do an interesting take on uh, filming. So she did one where nobody says anything. Almost like a silent film. Almost like that. But the thing is, the actors who really stepped in, like uh, uh, Mernaz Mohammadi and Pritesh Shah, they just brought so much with their emotions and how they reacted to each other. And it was, it was uh, based on the fact that uh, Carmen had dealt with fertility issues. And so she wanted to create this story and, and uh, take some risks. And so that's what happened. Well, it takes really good yeah. acting to portray yes. messages instead of dialogue. Yes. Um, one that just jumps to right of my, uh, to my head is Kurt Russell. He did this movie called Soldier where he didn't speak the entire movie. It was all facial expressions. Mm -hmm. And that takes skill. Yes. Yeah. So they had to really uh, feel what they were uh, experiencing. And they were top notch. And we were so lucky to have them. And, uh, and then add in there uh, that Peyton Skelton, who was also involved with both of my projects. He is a co-producer, uh, uh, co-writer, and also uh, the director of Afterthoughts. Mm. And, uh, and also we had, um, he was the director of photography for the Peck situation. So it's kind of a little bit of a family going on there. Yeah. But it, it's nice to work with people that you know and support their visions and their dreams. And that's, yeah, once you've done enough films with a certain group of people, yes. you, you slowly weed out, uh, you know, you get, you get the prime team together. And right. those are the ones you want to hold on to, especially in this industry. You want to have that core team family. It sounds like you found one. Yes. And, and, um, and then just for fun, there are three other films I'm associated with here. Do tell. Uh, three films also that I think you should put on your list to see Intervention, mm -hmm. that I was an executive producer, and I have a very uh, small cameo role in, uh, which looks at um, uh, ish uh, drug, in, or, uh, yes, drug, 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 drug problems <laughs> and intervention, yes. Yes, and also um, Turnover, which is going to be on Saturday. Yes, the big red carpet yeah. premiere. <laughs> big red, red carpet premiere. Um, I, and also Cat Dex, mm -hmm. that I was a co-producer on that one. So, but I'm representing these two, and then my colleague, Linda Palmer, uh, has got the other three wrapped up. She'll be representing oh, them. Yeah. Well, Linda's, Linda's a, a <laughs> force on her own. She's amazing. She's so amazing. proud of her. I mean, oh, so I know. Proud of her what she's done in a short period of time, her accomplishments have just been amazing. So. And I also wanted to give a shout out to Lynn Tinter, who wrote the book Afterthoughts. She actually made a series of books, and it's uh, the one thing is if there's anybody out there that has any Kentucky or Louisville uh, association, it, this kind of is a nod to that. And a series of books is written about Louisville, and it's kind of the second character, not so much in our film, but certainly in her books. Very nice. Well, Diane, thank you so much, and good Thanks luck for with your films. Thanks for having me. Oh, no problem. Thanks. Come and see all the films. are great. Yes. <laughs> all of them. So right here at the WME Theater in Pine Top, Lakeside, Arizona. Get here today, tomorrow, and Saturday, and uh, Sunday. Sunday. Yep. Yep. We'll be doing that as well. We have the red carpet premiere for Turnover on Saturday night. I think it's 6, six or 7. You'll just have yes. to come check yes. it out. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. 6 to but 7. But get here early. So thank you. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. Bye-bye.